Hi, I'm Dr. Julie Steinauer, and today I want to kind of continue a talk and discussion about working with patients who have lazy eye or amblyopia. And this is a condition that's really quite serious. It's one in which one eye doesn't develop eyesight properly. And so it prevents that child from ever be, being able to have truly two-eyed vision or binocular vision. Um, these are some fun games that we can do and play to actually improve the ability of that eye to work together as a unit with the other eye. So we're going to try on some red-green glasses here. And these are two different games and activities that we have. One is a fishing game, which is fun. The other one is a puzzle. When I put the glasses on, what happens is as I look at this picture, the red lens, which is over my right eye, will only allow me to see these things here, which are located in red. If I'm using my left eye, I can only see these items. So the idea in wearing the glasses is that we want them to not lose any animals or let them go black or missing. If they go black or missing, it means that one of their eyes isn't being paid attention to. And as the person working with that patient, we can find out which eye it is that's being ignored by knowing the colors of the lenses and what they do. So we're going to go fishing. Um, that's a puzzle game, by the way, but now we'll go fishing. And on this one, it's the same thing. If one eye is not being paid attention to, we can tell that they're ignoring it. And on this particular game, there's a little magnet on here. There's magnets on the cards. They have to pay attention to it and be able to go fishing. There's some eye-hand coordination with this activity, as well as improving their ability to keep their two eyes working together as a unit. Again, great tools, fun things to do for kids who have amblyopia or lazy eye. Visit us at visionforlifeworks.com to find out more. Thank you.